Opal Beaters, it's Gina from OrchidandOpal.com and today I have the September 2019 Bargain Bead Box, one of my very favorite subscriptions here to open up on the channel. I've been a member with them for over a year and I always look forward to getting this package in the mail. I know a lot of you guys do too. If you are interested in signing up, I'll let you know right away that you can use the code OPAL2, O-P-A-L-2, to save $2 off your first month's box. It is $17.95 a month if you're in the U.S. with free shipping included. It really is a bargain. So every month they have a great theme with lots of beads and findings that are coordinated. The color schemes go together really nicely and the metal findings are all sent in the same finish. So I have no idea what is inside, but I can't wait to find out. Here is our little package of beads inside the tissue paper and let's take a little peek at that. So we have a beautiful purple organza bag that just so happens to match my nails. That was not planned by the way. And then we have our list inside and on the other side of that we have a little note we can find out what our theme is and it looks like our theme is called a flight of fancy it says soar on rose gold wings through dreamy amethyst skies with this month's collection gemstone star with amethyst quartz crystal and agate selections glass and crystal accents in sunny jonquil stormy gray and sparkling peach combined with a selection of rose gold finish findings to complete the look that sounds absolutely amazing. Then of course we have our little coupon for their sister site, which I share through haul videos every single month. And they always have a contest. So if you make something from the box, you can submit that as an entry. And you never know, you could be chosen by random to win a $25 credit to their shop. And like I was saying on the back of that is our list of everything that is included in this month's collection. You can see that we're going to get a total of 18 different items. So if you want to break it down by the number of items we're getting, it would be about a dollar per item at that $17.95 a month price point. So great deal. All right. So I will leave this here for just a second in case you want to refer back to it for any reason, but we're going to go ahead and get started and go through everything one by one. We're going to start with number one, which looks like it's going to be some bead caps. All right, so here we go. Number one, 20 pieces of eight millimeter six point bead caps. I think the last time they did rose gold and I could be mistaken was back in the winter. It was like January or February. So it's nice to see it coming around again. So here are the little bead caps. They are just so sweet. Taking a close look at all the little details they have on there. They have the six little points on there. Kind of look like little flowers. Always a nice useful thing to get in the subscription. Speaking of something useful, here is bag number two, and this contains 10 grams of 21 gauge, 50 millimeter brass eye pins. Another very useful thing. Not necessarily the most exciting thing, but useful. And that is what you can expect from this particular subscription is you are going to get findings along with your beads. So that's something to keep in mind if you are considering signing up is if you want to get coordinating findings to go along with your beads. I think it's great, especially if you are a newer beater, but great for anybody because it makes it really easy to put together finished pieces from the collection. All right, bag number three, we're getting started in some of our beads and this contains an eight inch strand of six by four millimeter Chinese crystal rondelle beads in metallic peach opal. Aren't they beautiful? They are so sparkly and they are kind of a half and half. So half the bead is the metallic peach and half of it is that opal. I love it. So getting Chinese crystal rondelles is not always the most exciting thing, but then when they provide these very fun and beautiful strands with mixes of colors and finishes, that's when it does seem a lot more fun to me. I'm just moving these around so you can get an idea of just how sparkly those are. All right, bag number four contains a nine inch strand of four millimeter frosted glass round beads. And these are in the color matte gray. These are actually beautiful. It's a very frosty looking effect when they have the matte finish. It is a medium, what I would consider a dove gray. And I think they're gonna provide a very nice accent color to the color palette that we have here in this collection. Those are actually quite beautiful. Next up is bag number five, and this contains 20 pieces of six millimeter half ball steel ear stud findings with plastic ear nuts. So this is something different that I don't recall ever receiving before in the subscription. So it's nice to get something a little bit different findings wise. I think once in a blue moon, they'll provide some little stud ear findings like this. Look how many you get. You get a whole handful here, you get 20 pieces. So essentially you can make 10 pairs of earrings with that. 
there is the finding there looking at it from a front view so you can see how it has the little loop down there that's where you can attach some beads or connectors or whatever you want to add down below that little semi round right there and I love that it comes with plastic ear nuts as well very cool to get these then next up we have bag number six and this contains a 23 inch strand of six millimeter glass half frosted barrel beads in jonquil AB so we have gotten these types of beads before. They are a nice glass bead with the frosted effect on either side. And then the center of it is a nice smooth and shiny, transparent, just clear glass. And then that AB finish gives it that rainbow effect under the light. And this is a humongous strand. I mean, it's usually pretty good when you get a 15 or 16 inch strand of beads, but this is 23 inches. So that's quite... A bit you can see it's filling my palm there that's another thing I love about this subscription is you really just can't beat it price wise and you're getting such a nice coordinating selection of things all right bag number seven contains eight pieces of 16 millimeter steel alloy lobster claw clasp another basic great thing to have these are a little bit larger size being that they are a 16 millimeter which I really like and again you get eight pieces not just one or two they are so generous with how much they send. Number eight contains two pieces of 42 millimeter filigree style wing pendants. These are quite sizable and should make some very fun pendants. That finish on them is just so metallic and shiny. You can see it's got the main round hole up there, but so many different segments that you could also use. These are something that definitely gets my wheels turning and hopefully I'll be back to share something interesting with these in the future. Bag number nine says it contains six pieces of 22 millimeter filigree style wing pendants. So we've got to take a closer look at these. These look really beautiful. I think there's a lot you can do with them, just taking these in initially. So they're called wing pendants, which I can see why. They're also kind of maybe an elongated fan shape. You could certainly put two of them together like this and use them that way or use one of them separate because it's got so many little spaces running around these and I know they're really shiny, so I hope I don't blind anybody, but they have so many spaces there where you could connect beads, use these with resin. I mean, really there's a lot of different things you could do with these so it's always fun you'll find the bargain bead box a lot of times will send these interesting metal components and it's a great way to get creative and think outside the box and look how many again you get six of these all right bag number 10 contains 30 pieces of 15 millimeter feather charms is that right 30 pieces so here is a close look at these and you can see that they are not double-sided one side looks like that and then the other side is just slightly rounded with none of the etched details these are very pretty and I think they fit in nicely with the theme once again just such a huge amount and plenty to share if you have any other beading friends you want to share these with one other thing I want to mention is that it says these are charms there's actually a hole on either side so you could use these as connectors so that's even more useful in my opinion because I know for me personally I go through a lot of connectors and you can use multiple connectors in one piece pretty easily all right next up is bag number 11 this says it contains 10 pieces of 10 millimeter Chinese crystal coin beads in smoke peacock iris I think we've got something similar to this before these are a fun and flashy little faceted round and actually they are not quite round like it says they are a coin bead so they are pretty round but they're more of an oval shaped or a very puffed coin shape. So that is a look at the hole right there. They're actually quite smooth and seem to be decent quality and you can see how beautiful they sparkle. I don't see any that are damaged or have any defects so these do seem to be very nice. These are beautiful. All right, bag number 12 contains 50 pieces of five millimeter corrugated saucer spacer beads. Another great useful item to have. I know I personally go through a lot of spacer beads, probably even faster than bead caps. So these are very small, which is typical of spacer beads. And I'm just showing you that up close look so you can see all the little details along the sides there. They are very metallic they have a high shine on them and coordinate so well with our other findings. Next up is bag number 13 containing 20 pieces of 25 millimeter feather links. And right away, I'm thinking there might have just been a little mix up on the bags. I'm thinking that number 10 that we looked at earlier was actually supposed to be our feather links. And I'm thinking that this bag is actually our feather charms because they don't have the hole on the other end. 
and you can see there are quite a few of them in here. So these are what I'm going to say are our feather charms. They are so cute and they are double sided. They are the same on each side. I have quite a few feather charms in my stash and different finishes just from over the years, but I don't have any in rose gold and I don't have any quite in this shape. I love how dainty and small they are, but they still feel of nice quality where you cannot bend them. They don't feel really cheap. But again, you get so many. There's enough here to share if you wanted to. Next up, we have bag number 14, and this contains a seven and a half inch strand of 10 millimeter natural crystal quartz round beads. So these are very basic, but they will go so well with the rose gold. I mean, the rose gold is going to be kind of the star if you put them with something like this. I'm recalling the past theme when we had gotten the rose gold with all of the white, and it made some absolutely classic and stunning pieces. I will try to link that up in the corner if you are new to my channel and haven't checked that out, but I made a lot of pieces with the rose gold and white color scheme that I think came out really nice. So yeah, nice to get some clear round quartz beads. They will be very easy to work with since they will go with so many different things. Bag number 15 contains one meter of three millimeter steel Rolo chain. I'll pop that out so you can get a closer look at the shape of the links. Very metallic, that three millimeter, it's really versatile. And the Rolo chain's great even for extender chain if you wanted to cut this up in pieces and use it for that because you have those nice wide open links that are easy to attach to with your, say, lobster clasp. And that one meter is great to make multiple products projects with not just one so this will really go pretty far all right bag number 16 contains says approximately 36 millimeter brass wire wrap natural amethyst pendant so I can see the wire wrapping already right there at the top already in place for us and it's in another little plastic bag and there we go I love getting pendants with the subscription box as well you'll find that they do usually send at least one very nice focal that coordinates with what they've sent and this is wire wrapped very nicely it's also got the double loop there at the top so it's going to hold together better than if they had just done a single loop up there and there is a close-up look at the amethyst pendant I I got and all of them are going to look just slightly different of course because they are stone and that's just the nature of the material. I am a lover of amethyst so I'm excited to get something like this in this month's box. Bag number 17 contains a 16 inch strand of natural amethyst tumbled pebble beads. So that's really cool, a 16 inch strand, nice and long. Once again, you get a lot of them on this strand and these pebble beads are just slightly irregular. They're not a basic round shape, which is so much fun. They're all just a little bit different. You can see that these are in a nice range of deeper, darker purple and then some lighter, but most of the colors that you see here on this strand are very rich. There's only very few of them that are kind of washed out and they're all nice and smooth. They're not jagged. So I think this is a beautiful strand of amethyst to work with. And then finally, our bag number 18. This contains a seven and a half inch strand of eight millimeter semi-round faceted crackle agate beads. And of course, these are dyed agate to get that brilliant purple color. They are so rich. This one, the lighter one here, you can see the little veining that's inside of that bead. And as I move them around, you can see the little bit of faceting, although they are still very much rounded and glossy on the outside, giving them that juicy appearance and a great pairing with the purple of our amethyst and should be beautiful paired along with our rose gold. A really interesting combination of colors and findings this month. And every month it is completely different. So that is everything for our September 2019 bargain bead box. Once again, you just gotta love the bargain bead box. You get so much for your money shipped to your door, all coordinated for you, not just beads, but findings and focals and everything you need to make several very nice pieces and get you inspired and get you going, especially if you're newer and you don't have a stash built up. It's a great way to build up your stash over time or at least feel like you can make something right away and you don't have to figure out what to buy 
Monday and wait till you have most everything you need. So it's just an all around great subscription for newer and more experienced beaters alike. Like I said, if this particular color scheme is not something that speaks to you, I suggest that you check back over my past unboxings through my bargain bead box playlist and you will see how different they are every single month. Like I always say, I'm not here to sell you a box. It's just a lot of fun for me to share the contents with you guys and give you the opportunity to see if this is a box that is right for you and your beading style and your budget. If you would like to sign up for this box and you haven't yet, definitely take advantage of that coupon code OPAL2, O-P-A-L-2, to save $2 off your first month's box and get your first bargain bead box shipped to your door for only $15.95. I do believe they do offer international shipping, but of course, you'll have to check on that through their website depending on where you're located, and that is going to come with its own specific international shipping fee. So thanks again, you guys, so much for being with me. I really do appreciate it. Feel free to leave me a comment down below. Let me know if you enjoyed this particular theme, if you've gotten your own bargain bead box yet this month, if you're excited to play with it, or anything else you'd like to say. As always, once I've gotten a chance to play around with these beads and findings, I will be back to share them in a future finished jewelry update. I will have another one of those coming up within the next few days from past subscription box content. So stay tuned for that if you're interested. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day and as always, happy beating. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. For more content like this, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified of my latest videos. You can check out the information section below this video for links to all my social media handles, recommended products, and my shop and blog at orchidandopal.com. Thanks for watching!